its debut on Fox Sports 1 from Portland, Oregon tonight as one of the top teams in the league. The Chicago Red Stars pay a visit to the Portland Thorns. Kickoff just minutes away. Another great crowd expected in Providence Park tonight. This city is always ready for some soccer, and the Thorns are playing some of their best of the season, coming off two straight wins. Meanwhile, the Chicago Red Stars come in on a six-game unbeaten streak. And this game has big implications for both teams as you take a look at the standings. Seattle is on top, having bumped Chicago from that top spot. And Portland, meanwhile, fighting to get into one of those top four spots to make the playoffs. So excited to have you guys along. I'm Jen Hildreth. Also excited to have my World Cup partner, Kinder D. San Alvin, back alongside. And when you talk about the NWSL, you almost have to talk about the World Cup because of all the players who are out there on the field. Well, and both of these teams suffered a lot of losses in player perspective with that World Cup. The Portland Thorns were missing 10 of their stars for World Cup duty. And of course, the Red Stars missing eight players. The Thorns really seem to struggle. They got one win during that stretch as opposed to the the Red Stars, four wins during that time. So they somehow weathered the storm a little bit rather better than this Portland team. Chicago has played very well, but they're coming off a couple of draws, gave up some points. They thought they could have gotten there, but one of their World Cup stars who has just been on fire since she's been back is Kristen Press, and she's standing by with Danielle Slayton. So down here on the sideline with Kristen Press. Kristen, what was it like to win the World Cup and then the craziness that happened in the subsequent month? This whole summer has been totally insane and in the best way possible. Uh, emotional extremes, traveling, seeing this country support us. Uh, the reception was phenomenal and we're all so excited to continue that here with our NWSL teams. And what's important to focus on the game as you guys get integrated now back into your NWSL team and the Chicago Red Stars? I think that's exactly it. Just the integration, like working with the girls. This game and and our next few games are about us, learn each other, getting the chemistry, because the team did so well while we were away. Um, and it's been a little bit of an adjustment getting back, but I think that once we hit full stride, we're going to be a dangerous team and someone that's really hard to beat. Great. Good luck in the game. Thank you. Well, Kristen Press may say it's been a bit of an adjustment coming back, but you wouldn't know it from the way that she has played. Eight goals in six games this season for the Red Stars, including four in the last two matches against the Thorns. These two teams have played the five straight draws, but they need points tonight. We'll see if either team can come out on top. Line up. 